Here again, Mr. Independent, Lou Dobbs. Critics of uh, President Obama's Supreme Court uh, choice, uh, Judge Sotomayor, say she's a judicial activist who could put her political agenda above law. One issue that will surely come under scrutiny, her decision favoring the city of New Haven, Connecticut, a case in which 20 white and Latino firefighters sued the city of New Haven for racial discrimination when they were denied promotions because there were no African-American candidates in the top 20 after that promotion test. That case is now before the U.S. Supreme Court. Inez Ferre has our report. The Supreme Court Justice nominee, Sonia Sotomayor, proudly embraces her Latina background. In a 2001 lecture, Sotomayor said that the gender and ethnicity of judges does and should influence decisions, saying, quote, I would hope that a wise Latina woman with the richness of her experience would more often than not reach a better conclusion than a white male who hasn't lived that life. A comment that outrages conservative critics like the group Judicial Watch, which says that if confirmed, Sotomayor may rule more on the basis of racial identity than law. It's outrageous and, and uh, racist on its face and uh, if a, a nominee uh, that had conservative credentials had made a similar uh, though reversed statement uh, they'd be left out. They would never be put on the court. But one liberal academic says too much is made of these comments and not enough of her legal opinions. I don't think that having a particular background is necessarily going to cash out as having a particular writing style or a particular opinion. And if you actually read the over 400 opinions that she has written, you see that she is a judge's judge. One case that will get greater scrutiny is Sotomayor's role in dismissing the appeal of 19 white and one Latino firefighters from New Haven. They claim they were denied promotions despite doing better in exams because not enough minority candidates qualified. Sotomayor was part of a three-judge panel that in a one-paragraph summary sided with a lower court. Other judges on the court criticized the decision, arguing it failed to grapple with questions of exceptional importance. Some have certainly suggested that it was not only unusual to handle a case like this in that fashion, but that it almost seemed like the court was trying to, to make the case go away or brush it under the rug. The Supreme Court apparently agreed it decided it would hear the firefighters' appeal. And legal analysts expect that Republicans on the Senate Judiciary Committee will want to ask Sotomayor about her role in the firefighters' case as well as her comments about ethnicity and the bench. Lou? Thank you very much. And as for Ray, Judge Sotomayor.